Simple Pages is a content management module developed for Social Engine 4 by socialnatives.com. Simple Pages provides advanced functionality not found in competing modules, like a big, beautiful page editor that's enhanced with CSS capabilities, as well as a pretty cool file manager that lets you upload any file from Flash, QuickTime videos, to word processing documents, spreadsheets, and PDFs. So there's no limit at all on what kinds of files can be uploaded using our file manager. So let me briefly demonstrate Simple Pages. What we're looking at here is the page editor. This is where you create your web page. A list of the pages you've created would be displayed on this tab, and you can change settings such as which file types are supported in the file manager in the general settings tab over here. And the about tab gives you insight into what's happening at our company, socialnatives.com. So to begin creating this page, I simply add a page title. That title is used as the page's URL, and you can change it anytime just by editing this page. I'll quickly add some text and then make some common styling changes. Next, I'm going to add an image. And, you know, unlike other SE4 plugins, you don't have to FTP your images up or rely on some other cumbersome way to get your images into your content. Because we've added a file manager, and that lets you upload files directly from your computer to your web server. And you can upload any file, and you can upload multiple files at once. A nice little progress indicator shows you the progress of each file as it's being uploaded. So let me select one of my uploaded files. I'm going to insert it, and I'm going to align it to the right. But, you know, I want to jazz it up a little bit. So I get to use this new cool CSS function. So I want to add a thick gray line to the left of the photo. So I click the photo, then I click the new styles icon. I choose border and set the options that I want. I want a solid left line of four pixels wide. And then I want to choose gray from our great color picker. Next, I think I want to add some padding to the left of my line and maybe some margin between it and the picture so that it that line stands off from the text and from the picture. So I'm going to click apply and I see an update beneath my window. Yeah, that looks right, so I'll go ahead and commit my update to it. Next, I'm going to add the videos that I uploaded at the beginning. We support a wide variety of videos and embedding methods, so since Simple Pages doesn't need to convert between formats, there's no need for FFmpeg. Let me demonstrate adding a flash video. That's pretty straightforward. Uh, and yeah, let me go ahead and demonstrate adding a QuickTime video. So your iPad and iPhone users will be happy here. There's lots of configuration options at your fingertips as well. So on to publishing it. I give my page a description, and then I'm going to choose to add this page to my main navigation menu with the click of a button. I can control which member levels can see the page. I'm going to show it to everybody. And I can mark the page as published or not. With a save, I now see it in my list of pages that I've created. And since I added it to my main nav, now when I go back to my community, the page appears in the menu as expected. And there it is. That's Simple Pages. Pick up your copy at socialnatives.com.